Hey guys, Louis from Savvy Digital here and today we're going to be talking about Google AdSense, what it is, why you might want to use it and who it works best for. So what is Google AdSense? It's basically a way of you implementing monetization into your website or blog using Google's automated way of media buying. So they have programmatic advertising set up similar to the way Google Ads work and it allows them to basically automate the process of getting advertisers onto your website or blog and also getting the best price for that with their automated bidding. So with Google Ads and AdSense generally, as you can see, with people that have the most relevant ads for your website or blog, they will most likely win the bid, especially if they have the higher bid amounts as well. So it basically automates the process of you getting those advertisers on it and getting the best price with the most relevant ads to be shown. So you can see here with their three main factors, over 2 million people have chosen AdSense. First one is obviously the monetization aspect, being able to earn money from your website with relative ease. So millions of advertisers compete for your ad space. That means more money, more relevant ads, and more ad space is filled. As well as this, ads are optimized for mobile, so they basically optimize it based on the layout of whoever's visiting the website, and they automatically fit it to the desktop, tablets, or mobile, meaning there's more chance that they'll be seen and clicked, which is obviously better for both you and the advertiser. Lastly, it's saving time. So you only have to add one piece of code to your site, and Google automatically show ads basically tailored to the site layout, saving you time and also effort generally just making changes to the code. This works the same way with YouTube as well. When you have AdSense implemented, it allows you to have earnings based on every thousand views. So you can see here, it actually gives a rough estimation of how much you could earn from AdSense itself. So I've put in an example structure here so you can see Europe, Middle East and Africa with a blog or website based around autos and vehicles. So if you have monthly page views that sit around 50,000, you can see here your potential annual revenue, obviously it's an estimation, will be around $3,336. This calculator goes all the way up to 10 million views per month. And you can see here, this will net you around $667,200, which is not a bad salary if you're able to get that monthly page views. Obviously, that is an interesting amount because obviously on an annual basis, that's around 120 million views. But if you can, it's a good way of making money. So look at the benefits here. You can see that they've got the only highest paying ads will go live and also they'll be relevant to the advertisement itself or the website content that you're showing. You know, sort of quality score similar to how it works in Google Ads itself. You can see the right ads for your audience as well. So it's going to screen it to make sure they're high quality and relevant to your content or audience. So we'll use their algorithm and their automated and programmatic advertising features to create the result of you making more money based on the advertisements. So you can see here as well that you're in control. You can block the ads you don't like, customize them where they appear, and also choose which type of ads fit your content best. So you can see they've got a lot of testimonials from, you know, big CEOs such as Jack Herrick, who has the Ricky Howe website and stuff like that. You can see here as well, they have three sort of steps to get started, just a Google account, phone number, postal address, as well as connecting your site to AdSense by using the line of code. So let's talk about here. So there's a different ways of actually monetizing. So you can see you have automated ads as well as ad optimizations here. And if we go into the auto ads directory here, that specifically outlines what you can use it for. So you can see that uses an automated platform that makes smart decisions on your behalf and use their algorithm to do so. I can imagine similarly to Google ads though, you need a certain amount of impressions and you know, um, sort of a large data pool to get the algorithms work, you know, optimally, but that obviously ramps up over time. It focuses on creating great content, you know, buzzwords here, talking about, you know, potentially increasing your revenue and the ease of use generally for the sort of transferability across desktop and mobile. You can see here as well, it talks about responsive ads, talk about maximizing your earnings based on, you know, how it show on tablets, mobiles, and desktops as well. Again, talking about how it could just increase the output in terms of your revenue. Last of all, let's go on the Insights for Professionals website. They have a great blog which talks about the different types of Google AdSense ads that can be shown. Starting off with text ads, so you can see they have the usual text ads that come through um, the kind of Google uh, search ads themselves. And you can see they can be shown on the partner website, such as the blogs here, or they'll be shown up in the actual search function. We then have display ads as well as loads of different ones like banners, you know, vertical skyscrapers they're called here as well. Loads of different options such as square as well, whichever one fits your advertisement best and your blog. 
You can see rich media ads as well, which with like video ads, you know, you have different size ones, HTML ads as well, as well as link units to come down and link to the partner websites through there. Finally, we have responsive search ads, like I talked where it responds based on the layout of your website, whether it's um, using a mobile device, tablet or desktop. And finally, we have match contents as well, which is Google's version of content recommendation ads, which is run by Taboola and Outbrain. So it kind of has competitive aspects in that way. Anyway, that's going to conclude the video. If you have any questions about Google AdSense or how it works, leave it in the comments down below. And I'll be sure to answer it. If you enjoy the video, do give it a like and subscribe to the channel for more Google Ads related content. And if you want to optimize your Google Ads and make them as best as possible, watch the next video that's showing on the screen now.